It's a podcast about food. Yes. Oh my God. Do we have a special show for you? Yes, we do. Hey, everybody. It's the Hey Poopy Podcast with Dave and Ellen. And this is episode 154, but it'll always need number two to us. And two is our favorite n- number when it comes to couples for Valentine's Day. We have a very special show for you today. We are playing a game with two of our favorite couples. Yes. And the name of the game is... No, your booze poop. <laughs> it's called Know Your Booze Poop. Yes. Bing, 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 bing. It's kind of a little take on the Newlywed Game and the Parks and Rec version of Know Your Booze. So it's kind of a combo. Yeah. yeah. And we kind of put it together for our little shit show. So this should be really fun. Yes. <laughs> but before we go into our Valentine's Day special of Know Your Booze Poo, we like to go into our check-in. How's all of our couples been pooping recently? Let's go around the room and start with Kyle Bonbon. How have you been pooping recently? Uh, honestly, better than I ever have in my entire life, I think. Uh, Whoa. Wow. I'm I'm normally like an eight shits a day, uh, <laughs> lots, lots of c- crazy, uncomfortable, wild shits kind of guy. But recently, it's been like you know two or three times, very mellow. So Ooh. I don't know what I'm doing differently, but it's good. So excellent. Okay, that's good to hear. And Gigi Bonbon, how have you been pooping <laughs> recently? Um, very well. I've been pretty consistent. I have my morning poo, and then and uh, and it's been pretty good. And um, I think at least once or twice a day, but always in the morning, first thing. And uh, yeah, they've been pretty healthy lately. Good. Nice. Good to hear. And Frank the Coach, how have you been hey, pooping guys. recently? Um, I'm about... I'm about a Bristol three Ooh. right now. <laughs> I had to look it up again because I didn't remember no, okay. which one. Uh, which, which, but um, a little but yeah, I just... <laughs> A uh, little harder, a little <laughs> harder, and I, I think I went about twice today. Ooh. Yeah, so but but good, solid, figuratively and literally. <laughs> <laughs> and Troy, the trainer, how have you been pooping recently? Um, fairly well. I just had one before the podcast. Yes, so awesome. it was good. Oh. <laughs> um, Free yeah. brand. In the uh, toilet or in your pants? Oh, definitely in the toilet. Oh, good. That's good to know. We're safe. Yeah. We prefer That'd in the be pants. That'd crazy if you shit your pants and just did the whole show with this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I want to make a big impression. Yeah, so. right? <laughs> <laughs> Clearly. Um, we both pooped just before the show. Oh, excellent. Yeah, yeah. Do you have more than one bathroom in your apartment? We yeah. We do. Oh, yeah. so you were like stereo in the apartment each, each. Actually, yeah. He was he was in in one, and I was and I was in the other. Yeah. Wow. Oh, I dream yeah. of that. I can't wait till that day happens. <laughs> Having and multiple both, bathrooms. Two bathrooms would be perfect. Yeah. And they both have bidets. Ooh. Oh, nice. Fancy. Yeah. Like yeah. it. Yeah. Once you go bidet, you can't go back. Hell no. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. No, yeah. Agreed. Agreed. Yeah. And Dave, how have you been pooping? I'm fine. I went. I've only gone once today. Whoa! Nothing special. Another number five, Whoa. right up the gut, <laughs> or out the gut, I should say. A little loose but it in was the good. caboose. Yeah, it was fun. Um, I, I suspect I'll take another one at some point today. But uh, yeah, we'll see. And Ellen, how have you been pooping? I have been pooping horribly recently. I have been just pinching off ones. I have no idea what the fuck I did to my insides, but rabbit pellet city. I went to get my hair done yesterday and I could feel that I had to poop as soon as I got to the salon and I went in there and it was just literally like squeezing one little nugget after another and they were waiting for me and I was like, great, (laughs) I'm that person who's taking over the only bathroom at the salon to barely pinch anything off then today i did that twice again where i felt like i really had to poo and only little tiny rabbit pellets came out so i'm not very happy maybe i'll pop a laxative later but i do want to talk about i was on the phone with uh one of our past guests suck lord last week and 
um, he first texts me, do you have a minute to talk on the phone? And I was literally on the toilet and I was like, can you give me a minute? And then I called him and I was like, dude, I'm sorry. I had to shit. And he's like, very on brand of you. And he goes, I'm okay with you shitting on the phone. And I was like, yeah, but it's a little bit of an emotional one. I needed a second alone. And as I'm talking to him, my insides were like, round two motherfucker so suck lord yes i shit on the phone with you last week and you didn't know it i should have told you but i didn't so, I'm, sure he wouldn't, I'm sure he wouldn't have cared yeah i'm gonna see him tomorrow so i'm gonna tell him but cool. while, I, while you're in the middle of the act of doing so it's kind of like should i admit this it's not facetime but yeah there's there's a moment where i'm just like i'm gonna pretend like i'm not pooping okay well, you had a lot of activity. <laughs> I have. But as on brand always. Yes. Um, and with that, everybody's checked in. We wanted to actually check in with you guys to see like how have you been since you've been on the show last. I mean, everybody's been on the show except for Troy. So Troy, you're you're the newbie. But we'll get to you shortly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Gigi Bonbon was on episode twenty almost three years ago. Can't believe that. A lot has happened. And Kyle Bonbon was on episode 28. And we're on episode 154. So how much time has gone by? I know something as huge has changed in the two of your lives since then. We had a baby. Yay! Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations. Edie pooped in the toilet. Oh! Oh. She almost pooped in the tub, and then I pick. I knew she was because like I changed her diaper, and there was just a little bit of poop in there, and I was like, "Oh, she's probably gonna go in the tub." And then I, uh, and then I saw her like in her face that she does, and then I picked her up and I put her on the toilet, and she pooped on the toilet. Aww. nice. So cute. All she right. pooped three times in one day too. Wow, just like her daddy. Yep. That was very rare. <laughs> She's a good pooper. Ah. So yeah, you must be up to your knees and poop. Yeah. She's a year and a half now, so yeah, it's been a while. Lots of poop. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I can imagine. <laughs> Every parent we've had on this show all say we did not know how much poop was going to be in our lives until we had a child. I, I enjoy it. Ah. <laughs> well, I'm glad you do because uh, yeah, I mean, I couldn't imagine like just being like I just imagine there's like. Just the amount of shitting that kid must be doing is just out of control. <laughs> but I mean, that's cool. I mean, it's it's obviously healthy. Uh, yeah, it's healthy. It's good that they're going. It'd be it's worse much the other less way now though than it's been. Oh really? Yeah. What do you mean? It's more um, I mean, solid. Poo forever, but it's more solid, so you can just dump it in the toilet. So it's very uh, nice. Set. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> very cool. Very cool. Cloth diaper people. Yeah. Oh. Uh, gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Cool. And Frank, Frank the coach, who was on episode 81. 81. Hey, I don't know it was 81. That's the year I was born. Oh, um, nice. <laughs> same with Jillian. Oh, sorry. Gigi. <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll cut that out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, let's see. What's been new with me? Um, last time we met, I was still a city boy. I was living in Manhattan um, in about 375 square feet, which Ooh. I'm not knocking it because that's city life. We've Anybody who's lived in New York at some point or another has probably lived in a closet size, you know, apartment True. before and that you're paying $3,000 a month for. And, and we hustle and we love it because it's New York City. Um, but uh, yeah, I was like, you know what? Time to go back to my Jersey roots. So I moved back to Jersey and um yeah and then and then i met this guy over here actually i met him technically in the city but um we were we were uh virtual oh we were virtual ah. for the first uh for the first year year and change yeah and it's funny because you were just talking about pooping over the phone and i looked at him and i was just like we looked at each other because I was just like, I remember we were the first time we did that. <laughs> <laughs> so I, there was uh, if you if you're ready for a quick story, um, I was on the phone with him and we were talking and this was, this was an audio call. We usually, yeah. we, I mean, FaceTimes, it's hard to hide if you're pooping, <laughs> um, yeah. but, uh, I have been but, there. Uh, but audio, you know, you think you might be able to sneak off and, you know, to handle your business and who's going to know. Um, but 
I heard him. I heard like the echo of the voice change. So, you know, <laughs> I, heard the, I heard the reverb and the, and the acoustics change. But I'm like, I'm not asking anything because I was like, I want to see what he's going to do. Maybe he's just washing his hands or squeezing a pimple or something. But then sure enough, I hear I hear poop noises. <laughs> and I'm just like, and I'm like, what are you doing? And do you remember your answer? No, no. He says, <laughs> he said, I don't know. I think I might take a poop. <laughs> <laughs> While he was doing it? <laughs> After the fact, I was like, it sounds like you already did. <laughs> and we just both started laughing. That's what you said. You said, I don't know. I think I might take a poop. <laughs> so, you're, just playing, you're just playing shit and sound effects. <laughs> but that's romantic. Yeah, and then after that, we were... Was that? That's romantic. I feel like that's a real litmus test to who you, you to starting off as a couple. You know, if you can oh, have yeah. fun with that. Yeah. After that, we were pooping over FaceTime. And, <laughs> yeah, I mean, because you can't smell it. I mean, it's just it's video. You could hear all the noises and see all the facial expressions of this and, this and all that, but like you can't smell anything, so it's not really very offensive. It's just kind of fun. But um, yeah, you just reminded me of that with your story. Nice. Well, it's it's awesome you guys have two bathrooms because now you can like actually keep that you know no smell thing. And you could still yourself. FaceTime while you're could, doing I, it. We haven't done that yet. <laughs> we could totally still FaceTime. You're like, so what's up? <laughs> just shitting. <laughs> you know, how about you? <laughs> nice. But uh, yeah, that's the latest with me. Biggest move in my life since we last did the podcast was uh, my big move to Jersey. So yeah. And, right. and this one right next to me. Yeah. All right. And Troy, the trainer, do you want to tell us anything about your bathroom habits besides occasionally calling your boyfriend and pooping? <laughs> um. Oh, gosh. So this is all very new for me. Um, <laughs> <laughs> like I did not sign up for um, this. Like I said, you kind of did. <laughs> yeah. Well, when Frank like introduced me to like this whole thing, he's like, "Yeah, like I've been on this sh the, this podcast before," and I was like, "What? What podcast?" Is it? He's like, poop "Podcast," and I'm like, "Oh, like do they talk about poop?" And he's like, "Yeah," and I was like, <laughs> and I was like "Oh, what? okay, cool." Um, no, I don't know. I guess like, um, I mean, but we, even before you're that, like, "I'm when out." You first met me when you when you and I first met I was like farting all over the phone and oh stuff, yeah and even asking you questions about your farts and stuff like that and you're like I've never been this comfortable yeah yeah I kind of broke him so so, when, <laughs> so I guess before I met him I was very subconscious and like not really like farting anywhere or like trying to like but he kind of like made it a whole new thing for me so he broke nice. he broke he did break you the bar was set whenever yeah, yeah. <laughs> he broke the wind and broke um, you broke but, you yeah, yeah yeah so like no but i mean i don't know we have a lot of fun and like my biggest yeah. thing i guess i haven't been on the show yet but yeah i had a big move i moved from south carolina to here oh so, wow because our whole first year and a half not year and a half, probably yeah, year and a half. Yeah, maybe. I mean when I fit when I when I did the math, I was I fucked it up before. It was um we met in June, um virtually, and we met we started meeting in person November twenty twenty. So five yeah. months later, we started meeting in person monthly, once a month for however four many months, four or for five about, nights if that. Yeah, so, but yeah. for a whole year. So no, it was a year and a half that we wow. were. Wow, so impressive. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so that's. And then I, we realized that every time we had to leave and depart, like we were getting a little bit of like a separation anxiety. So it was just one of those things where we had to figure things out. And so I moved up here and been farting and pooping with him ever since. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's true love right there. I used, to, I, I used to encourage it, you know, on the visits because I only, it was only four or five nights. Now I'm just like, all right, you're going to sleep on the couch, mister. I'm like, this is getting out of hand. <laughs> I was like, you asked for this. <laughs> and Frank had, I, I want to play it again on um, social media when the this episode comes out, but you had that amazing montage of you farting. That's how we met. I forgot about that. Yeah. That's has, right. Has Troy seen that montage? Absolutely. He's so. <laughs> a celebrity. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he, was, he was very proud of it. I was very me. proud of it. <laughs> we were too. We yeah. fell in love with Frank the minute it came. We saw it. So very I think funny. you guys posted it on your page. Yeah. 
We definitely he totally did. did. Yeah. 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 That's right. You guys played that at the end of our uh, our episode, right? You did <laughs> yeah. audio at the end. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, funny. All right. Well, now that we've caught up, we know a little bit more about everybody here. And I think it's time to get on to this game. Woo! <laughs> hey. <laughs> so, um, I'm obviously going to cut all this up, but yeah. We're gonna do play this little intro quickly, and then we'll we'll go over the uh, the rules, and then we'll also this is for the audience mainly, and we'll go over our sponsors and what you guys could possibly win. Yes, so, it's a big surprise. So uh, here we go. It's time to play everyone's favorite game. No, you lose. So um. As everybody knows. You guys all got your own personal envelopes with your answers in it. Before this game started, we sent these questions to our lovely contestants. And when we ask your partner the question, you're going to flash the answer after when we prompt you to. So um, I don't. Well, basically, the way it works is the way Know Your Booze Poo works is for every um, for every answer, each member of the couple gets right. You get one point. Whatever team has the most points at the end of this, at the end of the questions, wins the game, and you definitely know your booze poo. Yes. <laughs> so, um, and a couple of like little small things. How's cleaning before we get started? But uh, my lovely co-host is going to kick it off. Yes, let's talk about our fabulous sponsors. The winning couple of Know Your Booze Poo will go home with two fabulous prizes of our very generous sponsors, B Vibe. And Bamboo. Yes, that's right. B-Vibe, the sex toy for people with kinky buttholes. <laughs> good, vib- <laughs> good vibrations, explore, educate, and empower. And Bamboo, the bamboo toilet paper that gives a sheet. Bamboo grows faster and uses less water and no harmful chemicals. Soft as a panda, yet strong as a bear. So with that, pri- <laughs> prize number one for our lovely couples uh, it's a v- B Vibes one and only anal training kit and education set. Ooh. Yes. Ooh. Going from zero to penetration is a big no no. That's where this training kit comes in. Developed by a certified sex educator, Alicia Sinclair, the seven piece set is complete with three sizes of plugs easy application, lubricant launcher, travel bag, and comprehensive how to guides. Plus more. <laughs> and that's a lot of stuff right there. So the more I can't even imagine. Um, with a retail price of $150. That's crazy. This kit covers every stage of an anal enthusiast journey into butt play. For more information, go to bvibe, that's B-V-I-B-E dot com to get your own kinky butt toys and use the promo code BVIBES. That's B-V-I-B-E-S for 20% off. Yes, you could get those butt plugs for yourself to all the lovely listeners out there. And our prize number two is a full (laughs) case, an entire case of bamboo toilet paper. That's 24 rolls of sustainable toilet paper that's good for your bum and the planet. Are you soft as a panda yet strong as a bear? Well, we have the perfect toilet paper for you. Bamboo is bamboo-based TP that's more sustainable than hardwood and so much better for the environment. With the retail value of $34, this environmentally friendly TP is the right choice. For more information, go visit Go Bamboo. That's G-O-B-U-M-B-O-O dot com and use promo code Hey Poopy to get 10% off your order. Give a sheet about your future and yours. Yes. <laughs> and one lucky couple will walk away with these two incredible prizes, but only if You can. It's time to play everyone's favorite game. No, you don't Yes. There's a lot of post production. There's a lot of production on that (laughs) intro. (laughs) So this, our prizes take care of three, uh, two out of the three of our themes of this show: pleasure and poop. We just didn't throw in a health one, but you have healthy, loving couples on the show. So who needs anything more? Yeah, eat a salad or something. (laughs) 
<laughs> Keep that gut clean, and if you're 45 and over, get a colonoscopy. Okay, we will move on to the game show. Open up your folders, please, and keep your answers down. As we take them out? Yes. You can just Are keep... Are they all in order? They yeah, should, they should be. be. They're, they're numbered. Um, at, I, I made Troy's and Frank's, and so the number's on top, and you just flip it over when you are ready not wh when we're ready to, for you to flip it over if that makes sense we're going to get this we're all going to get this together you know we we, <laughs> we got this you got it, you got it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right so ellen's going to start with gg first I'm going to go to Frank. We're going to keep ping-ponging until we get to those questions and then we'll move on. So I have Gigi's questions. Um wait. And so I am going to ask Gigi and Kyle's going to flip his answer over. Does that make sense? Yeah. Wait. Or is this is Gigi's <clears throat> answer? Kyle's. Yeah, Kyle, no, Kyle's got uh, hold on. <laughs> now you're screwed. Now you're screwed. Like are we supposed to ask Gigi the question? And then I believe Kyle's supposed to answer. Or no. No, she. Ha these are her answers. Yes, those are your answers. So we're asking Kyle the question. Yes, yes, yes. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Can we? Uh, <laughs> I literally wrote this out and I was like, I got this game. Now I'm just confusing the hell out of myself. Yeah. yeah, that's all. Yeah. So this first question is for Kyle with Gigi's answers. Yes. Ready? And Kyle, we asked Gigi, does she know your birthday? What did she answer? Is your birthday? Uh, she knows my birthday. But what is your birthday? March 26, 1990. Oh, and Jillian, your answer was? Oh, Perfect, just upside down. <laughs> there we go. Ding, 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 ding. Yay! All right. Get that asshole ready for poop and pleasure. All right, Troy, we asked Frank. Um, what's Frank's birthday? Troy's, yeah, yeah, Troy's birthday. Oh, sorry. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, we asked Frank, when's your partner's birthday? Yes, sorry, and this Frank. Is Troy's birthday. Yes. <laughs> so Frank, I'm oh, sorry, Troy, when is your birthday? Uh, February 14th, 1987. Aww. And now I flip, yep. yes? Yes. And his answer is correct. Very good. Nice. Very good. Got a one -one February 14th, one -one. 1987. Um, I love baby. Yes. So it, I love how Troy's birthday is on Valentine's Day when right a couple of days before after this episode comes out. But this is our Valentine's Day episode. Now we're going to go to Kyle's questions and answers. So, Jillian, you have to answer this. <laughs> what did Kyle write, Jillian, when he was asked, where did you go on your first date? We went to Red Hook on a bike ride to Red Hook and then we went to like the Key Lime Pie Place. We went to the Crab Shack. What else did we do? We went to a bunch of different places. Kyle, flip over your answer. Let's see if she is correct. Sunnies! Yes. Yay! Oh, nice. We also have a right answer. <laughs> what does it say? <laughs> All right. Put a lot of details into my answer. Yes. I did log answers too. Oh, I didn't put that. I, I did log answers. That's okay. okay. Oh, wow. yeah, we so, Frank, we asked, we asked Frank, we asked Troy, where did you go on your first date? Um, Our first date was, it's so funny because we were just talking about it. So, <clears throat> in November of 2020, we met in Richmond and we stayed in a hotel. And while we were there, we went to a bar um and actually funny enough he doesn't remember the name of it so i'm just and i don't either so if he's <laughs> referencing it and he remembered correctly it is the bar <laughs> in richmond okay well, <laughs> with well try to wait we... that we made fun of yeah that's all i can remember that's, that's <laughs> it the bar in richmond with the with the funny waitress that we made let's fun see of. what Troy Troy, answers. what's your answer flip over yes Woo! Yeah. <laughs> ding 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 right, right. we have That's another it. correct answer now everybody the questions are about to get much harder those were the softball ones let's get into the main event boops and farts ready 
Jillian was asked this question, Kyle, so we'd like to know what she answered. Jillian answered, who poops the most in your relationship? Who did she guess? We already know from the intro that she would have guessed me. (gasps) Oh, let's see. Jillian, flip over your answer. Yay! (laughs) It's Kyle. (laughs) He's a big old shitter. (laughs) We asked Frank, who poops the most in the relationship? What did, what, what did Frank say there? Troy, answer. Oh. No, I'm going to... Oh, uh, do yeah. I answer? I you answer. answer, yeah. Oh, gosh. Oh, wow. Probably me. Oh. And Frank, show us your answer. Troy does! Minor, <laughs> less frequent, but massive. Uh, you guys are like, I mean, <laughs> simpatico <laughs> here. Hey, wow. This is, this is a tight game. <laughs> <laughs> you guys got to frame that one and put it in the bathroom. <laughs> so far, we are tied in this game. Let's see if it gets more difficult. Ready, Jillian? Here is one of Kyle's questions. Do Does Kyle poop with the door open or closed? <laughs> open. Kyle? Yes! <laughs> Boom. All right. I do a lot too. Sometimes my wife does that and she will talk to each other from my office. So, <laughs> yeah, in there. romance. It, you know? Yeah. All right. Not so, my, my couple. My boyfriend will not let me even talk through the door at him while he's shitting. I'm not surprised. Because <laughs> he's a tight ass. Woo! <laughs> we asked Troy, do you poop with the door open or closed? Frank? In all the time we've been together, I can count on one, two fingers how many times the door was ever closed. It was probably because we were in a fight. <laughs> so I'm going to go with open at all times, wide open. <laughs> open. Whoa! <laughs> you guys really know each other. This is fantastic. Hey, these couples know their booze poo, that's Completely. for sure. Okay, Kyle, we asked Jillian, who farts the most in your relationship? This game is not reflecting well on me. (laughs) (laughs) No judgment. No judgment. I said, Kyle! Yay! And then I said, for a tie. Yeah, she does. (laughs) Awesome. All right. We asked Frank, who farts the most? Troy? Who do you think farts the most? Oh. I think I do. <laughs> All right, what did Frank say? <laughs> oh. Frank said he does because of his IBS. Well, good to know. Thanks. Wait, wait. So they got that one wrong. So they got that one wrong. You guys should definitely frame all these answers. <laughs> put, it in a, put it in a memory book. <laughs> Okay, Jillian, Kyle asked, was asked the question, have you ever taken a shit while your partner is showering? Jillian. I, yes, I have done that. So Kyle answered. He said yes. Ah, ding, ding, ding. <laughs> oh, I hate when that happens. You're just like, God. <laughs> you just have to. There's only I one know. point. No, around. I get it. I know, but it just like it ruins the whole shower experience. But yes. He did it when I was in the tub the other day. <laughs> <laughs> it was the best. Oh, my God. That was going to be a long wait. If I yeah, that's true. I'll give you that. The bath time's long. I do love farting in a bathtub, though. He could make your own jacuzzi. Bubbles. Yeah. yeah. We asked Troy, has your partner ever shit their pants when you've been around? Frank? Have I ever? Yes. Yes. Um, trying to think. <laughs> Since you guys like have been together. Part. Have you ever shit your pants? Frank, have you ever shit your pants that Troy knows of? I'm going to go with Yes. Oh, let's see, Troy. Let's reveal that number. <laughs> that was a lucky guess. Do you know there must be an exact occasion you're you're thinking of? Um. Yes. Please yes. do tell us. But I think you can share. It's fine. I don't care. I can't remember. 
I guess yes, I because I was like, I'm sure I must have. <laughs> I don't remember where it was at. I just remember we were on one of our trips. We were on a trip? Yeah. It had, of course. On vacation, it's either diarrhea or constipation. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Makes sense. All right. <clears throat> Kyle, we asked Jillian, name a food that makes Kyle fart. Oh, interesting. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna go for a weird one here and say she said uh, any food that I eat that is probably expired in the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> and Jillian, what did you say? Yes! <laughs> Have you ever taken a shit while your partner is showering? Oh, uh, who answers? So, so Frank's gonna answer that one. I'm supposed to answer. Yeah. 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 yeah absolutely. <laughs> yeah, yeah. and yeah. you you did and you brought the sign up for yes so actually, yeah, yeah, yeah yeah okay yeah so let's just do this ding 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 that was a yes ready kyle we asked jillian who is more likely to get diarrhea on vacation kyle what did jillian answer <laughs> or sorry Gigi answer oh wait you're oh wait oh wait you're asking Kyle who gets diarrhea on vacation, and I answer, right? No, no, I asked you that question. Showing it. Okay. I'm yeah, gonna... you're showing your. <laughs> um, but... no. no, I'm answering what I think you said. Right? Yes, yes. Yes. Yeah. Because on Gigi's questions and answer, it says, who is more likely to get diarrhea on vacation? So, Jalen, we asked you that question. Oh, okay. And then I, so this is question five for no, me? No, 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 no. I show. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. I answer and then I show. No. No, I answer. Well, you I answer, she shows. Kyle still has four. I'm, this is my question. Is this question five? Yes. Okay. I lied then. Uh, let's edit all that out. And here we Start go. Over again. We got okay. a little confused. I, I have questions over here. Yeah. We're yeah. Doing great I'm going to do. Breakfast. Okay. So Kyle's <laughs> questions and answers. Jillian, ready? What did yeah. Kyle answer? Has your partner ever shit her pants when you were around? And Jillian, what did Kyle answer? I mean, yes, I have. I have. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the no. no. <laughs> Sorry, Kyle. But what did you say, Kyle? He said, but I did shit my pants the day before. Eileen's wedding. What? <laughs> it says, but she did shit her pants the day before Eileen's wedding where we met. But I have sh I have pooped like little shards around you, I guess. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what makes this game so interesting. Do we actually remember? I feel like I'm high and I'm not. <laughs> um I feel all like right. we're all high. Yeah, yeah. So I didn't yeah. ask I didn't ask Frank this, but we're gonna find out. Do you want to say the number? So yeah, this is number. Up. This is number four. Got Name it. a food that makes your partner fart. We asked okay. Frank that. So Troy, answer. So Troy, what do you what think? What did oh, Frank say that makes you fart? <laughs> that makes me fart. Yeah. Um, what food do you, does Troy does for what Any, food does Troy? I mean Frank know that when Troy eats it, farts will be happening. This is just so I have to think because there's a lot of things probably. <laughs> <laughs> um, gosh, uh, I'm trying to think of the main one though. Probably like anything like spices and protein or. <laughs> Beans. Oh. Or... Stay with that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Frank, Frank, what did you answer? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Protein shakes. Protein though. shakes. Protein's okay. in there. Okay. But I did mention the fast foods and the hot dogs. Oh, okay. And yeah. funny enough, after we answered these, we had a recent discovery, and I had to tell him before we went on the show. Um, we just discovered like yesterday that brie and soft cheeses are like a major culprit. <laughs> and I said, okay, we're not cheating here. I said, but I just want to point out, we only discovered this about you today. <laughs> but if somebody <laughs> happened to ask you what makes you fart, I clearly would not have answered with brie. <laughs> I said, so I just need you to remember that it's not cheating. <laughs> um, gotcha. 
Yeah, I would imagine protein shakes are the, probably the biggest culprit. Anything protein, the protein bars. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. All oh, those I, protein cookies was it Larry's? Those are fiber cookies. Those are horrible. Yeah. <laughs> we gotta try those out. Larry's fiber <laughs> oh, cookie. You, you haven't? No. Oh. oh my goodness, they're very very high in fiber. If you ever want to clean your stomach out, yeah, go get that. Okay. Where do you them. buy them? Yeah. Um. We'll send you the link. Okay. It's, um, <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, and they're not just called Larry's. They're called. Um, yeah, I'll go grab one. Oh, we have a whole box that we never. Ate. Well, this this episode's coming out after. But the last week's episode that we haven't done yet, Dave and I are eating all these farty foods and wearing diapers and trying to see if we shart. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> We're calling it the brown hour. Uh, and it's coming out on February 2nd, 2-2-22. Ooh. Oh, I've seen those cookies. Okay. Oh, yeah, you've probably seen them at, like, a lot of gyms have them right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. like some, like, you know, um, uh, health food stores. So, yeah, it's Lenny and Larry's. I knew it was something else. Aren't those Lenny the guys from Baskets, that TV show on FX with Zach Galifianakis? Oh, I don't What's know. That? There's a Maybe. show called Baskets. Anyway, totally side note. So the culprit, the culprit in this is, um, and where is it on the back? It's a type of fiber. It's, um, you'll, and you'll appreciate this, Ellen, because you've talked about this before. It's, uh, it's chicory root fiber. Ooh. Chicory root is, um, is, I think it's inulin. Yes. Is the type yes. of fiber that's in it, which is the same fiber that's in, uh, sunchokes, Jerusalem yes. artichokes. Yes. Yes. So same fiber. You see the hair and the logo. That's like when you fart and it blows back. Yeah, that's what happens yes. in my face. That's what yeah. it's going to look like. Uh, except, even though I don't have any. Just use, use your imagination. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Your beard hair goes whoosh. <laughs> my yeah, beard actually. hair and my eyebrows. <laughs> just, yeah. Well, just we, we've gone through the first five questions, we, or four questions. We wanted to just catch everybody up here. I think we're at... We're in oh, a, tie. a tie. We're at 7-7. Seven, seven. Wow. All right. So everybody has lost... What, each team has lost one answer. Wait, what did we lose? <gasps> We didn't get one wrong yet. I thought yeah, they did. You did. You got um. I don't remember which one you got wrong, but you definitely got something wrong. <laughs> you got um. Um, oh, this. Have you ever shit <laughs> shit your pants when you're around? I yeah, think. technically, you answered with the wrong piece of paper. Yeah. And the answer you said yes, but it was actually no. So it was a fuck up oh, on our side. Oh, yeah. Yes, I would have known and I forgot about it. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, because as okay. I thought about it, I was like, I do it on occasion. Okay. All right. So, so it's a no. All right. Yeah. All right. But we're still tied. So there's, it's tied. anybody's right. game at this point. Yes. Right. Your Ready? assholes are still going to see some pleasure in pooping coming up. Hey. Ready? J we asked Jillian this, Kyle. So you have to answer. Question five Who is more likely to get diarrhea on a vacation? Kyle, Definitely. what did Jillian answer? Definitely me. Is Kyle? Oh! <laughs> All right. Okay, we asked Frank. Question number five. Who was more likely to get diarrhea on vacation? Troy, what do you think? Is, okay. That would definitely be me. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Troy! <laughs> All right. Now, Jillian, we asked Kyle this question. What do you think he answered? Number five, who has stinkier farts? Jillian, what do you think Kyle answered? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think he would say himself. <laughs> and Kyle, what did you answer? He said me. All right. We asked Troy, question number five, the same thing. Who has stinkier farts? Why Frank, answer? what do you yes. have, Frank? What do you think? This guy, he does. Troy, what is your answer? Yeah. Also a me. <laughs> Thank you for your honesty. Nice. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, moving along. Yes, question number six. We asked Jillian Kyle. We asked Gigi Kyle. Oh, my God. Mm. I need to yeah. Let's do that. Run that one. Run that one again. <laughs> Kyle, we asked Gigi Bonbon, bon, how many dates until you farted in front of each other? Kyle, what did Gigi Bonbon bon answer? Oh fuck, that's a hard one. Uh, 
Only a couple. <laughs> Only a couple. <laughs> and Jillian, what was your answer? I said, can't remember, but it didn't take long. <laughs> <laughs> I think that is a bang. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. <laughs> okay. We asked Frank, how many dates until you farted in front of your partner? Oh, God. What do you think, Troy? You farted on the first date. <laughs> 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 oh, whoa. Whoa. Good memory. Good memory. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I will never forget that. <laughs> <laughs> they say Virginia's for lovers. We think it's for farts. Yay! <laughs> okay, ready, Jillian? J- <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> ready, Gigi Bon Bon? We ask Kyle, who thinks farts are funnier out of the two of you? Which one of the two of you thinks farts are funnier? I think Kyle thinks farts are funnier. <laughs> Kyle, what did you answer? He said me. <laughs> Boom. All right. Yes. We asked Troy, who thinks farts are funnier? What do you think Frank answered there? What? Or me? No, no, no. He, I, you didn't ask me that. So why yeah. do I think he answered? Um, <laughs> <laughs> well, considering that before you met me, you didn't think they were that funny. Um, I'm going to say that you said I do. What did Troy answer? Frank! <laughs> Yay! <All right>. <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> throat> Kyle, these questions. <laughs> we asked Gigi Bon Bon, could you pick your partner's fart out of a crowded room? Kyle, what did Gigi Bon Bon answer? Could she pick your fart out of a crowded room? I'm going to say yes. <laughs> Jillian, uh, Gigi, yay! <laughs> All right. This one, we, this, was a, this, was, this was a Frank question. We asked Frank, could you pick your partner's farts out of a crowded room? Troy? Troy, what do you think? I'm going to say absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the answer is fantastic. Yup, and I have in public, straight up eggs. <laughs> Frank, do you want to tell us that story? You want me to tell it? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I almost want him to tell it. Um, well, so, I can I do your impression of you when we get to that part? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Um, <clears throat> so, well, this was several several dates in, but we were. This was. This was our first date with friends, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I had gone down to visit. My friends. Yeah, I had gone down to visit <laughs> in South Carolina. And we went, uh, oh, I know what happened. We went out to dinner, the two of us first. We had a nice dinner. And then we went across the street to a bar. And he ran into a couple of his friends there. And uh, no, didn't know. This, this was the second time we hung out with them. That was the yeah, first time. Yeah, you yeah. didn't fart that time. We all went out together, I think. We all went out together. Mexican food. We had Mexican food. And um, it's funny because I gave him a hard time that night, too. He had finished his food before everybody else. And he's like, it's fine. He's like, I just like to eat fast. And I'm like, okay. And then we go it to the bar. Good. And we, <laughs> we go to the bar. And we're sitting at the bar just having drinks, having a good time. And then what happened? And We're sitting at a booth. A booth in the bar. Nice. Yeah. So yeah, we're sitting down, and I'm thinking that I can maybe sneak one out, <laughs> even though that they everybody's like right beside each other, boxed and, in. And, and so I I let it out not loudly but like carefully, like I didn't even raise anything. I just kind of like just neutral. And then we're talking, and <laughs> and out of nowhere, like Frank goes. Yo, who the fuck farted? And like, <laughs> and you and, guess, and, <laughs> I'm not from the South. So where I'm from, if somebody farts in a group of people and you smell it, you call it out. Yes. You're just like, all right, seriously, guys, what are we in fucking third grade? Like, who the fuck farted? Who's going to oh, come on? Somebody own it. You know, I think in the South, if somebody does it, you might all sit there politely and be like, mm-hmm. well, usually I was thinking in my head, like one of the turkey trucks came by and was like, that's what you're smelling. <laughs> it wasn't a turkey truck. <laughs> you yeah. lied. You lied. So, I love it. Yeah. So, but then we all told shit and fart stories for the rest of the night. Like, nice. If only Hey Poopy Podcast was a fly on that wall. 
Yeah, exactly. Yeah. We told we all had a shit and fart story to make him feel better. We all <laughs> have had an embarrassing moment. Yeah. And uh, then yeah. I went to the bathroom. <laughs> and I let it all out. I like it. Yeah, let the rest of it out. Yeah. Opened up that dam. All right. Well, moving along. G- Gigi Bon Bon. We asked Kyle Bon Bon, have you ever farted while your partner was going down on you? What did Kyle say? Gigi Bon Bon. <laughs> <laughs> Kyle's got the best laugh. <laughs> I feel like I have. <laughs> no, no, I, no, I think uh, it means has Kyle ever farted while you oh, were going when down? I, when I, wait, 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 wait. You're asking me? No, we asked Kyle. Kyle, okay. have yes. has Kyle ever farted while Gigi was going down on you? I don't think so. Kyle, what was your answer? <laughs> A big fat no. <laughs> Nice. Fired. No, but yeah, we got <laughs> the rest. We well, have to pause for a moment because he has really it is the best priceless, like little like little. It's a no, know, but I fought print. hard against many blowjob farts. <laughs> <laughs> we've all we've all been there. <laughs> no, that is so Maybe funny. that la- makes it last a little longer because yeah. you're like clenching, <laughs> holding in, not very, relaxing. Very yeah, yeah. <laughs> little prostate stimulation while you're getting it. A little air bubble. Woo! All right, Frank. We asked Troy, "Have you ever farted while your partner's going down on you?" All right. So just to clarify, is it which one of us is it? Troy, I know I answer. Tr- yes, you answer. I know I answer, but who who's the one who's going down and who's the one who, who may have farted? Troy's going down on you. And have and you have ever farted, farted while your part while Troy is going down on you? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and what did Troy say? <laughs> yes. Right. yes I have. <laughs> <laughs> wow, we're gross. Yeah. <laughs> We're not as classy as them, so <laughs> we're disgusting. It's all good. Can you guys answer that after just that one? Because <laughs> yeah, right. I'd like to hear from both of you. If the tables were turned, yes. Uh, Kyle, has Jillian ever farted? Oh, definitely. <laughs> yes. <laughs> And Troy, have you ever farted well, Frank? So, nice. uh, you, Alan, and Dave. Yeah, that's what I wanted to know. I've ever, I don't think I've ever farted while my partner was going down to me, but it's definitely been the other way around for sure. Or let's just give me the heads up, like, hey, I'm gonna, something's gonna happen, and then I pop up. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I get a little heads up. Yes, I have done that too where Gerald has been going down on me and I was like, you need to move your face right now because I don't have a choice. <laughs> and one time Gerald and I were just having sex and I couldn't stop farting and he <laughs> he was so mad, but he was laughing at the same time. He's like, can you just stop? And I couldn't stop laughing as his wiener's like, inside of me and farts candle. are popping out. He's got like he's got like Febreze. And, like, yeah. <laughs> and when you when you laugh, the farts come out more. Yes, yes. It was yeah. like a shotgun. I mean, a machine gun. <laughs> yeah, but his yeah. dick stayed hard, so he wasn't that turned off. Ba bum bunch. Thank you guys. Yeah. <laughs> I love yeah, that I feel one. much better now. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Back to the game. It just sounds like Kyle holds it in because he knows that uh, Jillian's a lady. Or because his yeah. smell worse. Or me, yeah, that too. It's a combination. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Kyle, we asked Gigi Bon Bon. Number eight. What did Gigi say, Kyle, too? How many times has your partner shit their pants? How many times, Kyle, has Jillian said that you have shit your pants? In my life? Um, It doesn't really specify. Maybe... Right. I would say since you've probably been together. Yeah. Since it's a couple thing. How many times did Jillian say that you I have... I was sh- thinking of it as your life. Oh. oh okay, but I mean... I well, I mean... Story. But I don't know. Yeah. I feel like you probably only remember one of the stories. Is that your final answer, Kyle? Um, I'm going to go with the vague... 
a couple of times. <laughs> uh, Jillian, what did you answer? I don't have too many to count. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Is that a, a, a judge's panel? Yeah, that's a hard one. A couple one. times versus too many to count? I think that's a no. All right, we're going to go with no then. Okay, sorry, y'all. <laughs> sorry, guys. We had a bummer. I mean, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Troy, we'd ask Frank, how many times is your partner shit their pants? <laughs> sorry, that's a funny question. Um, <laughs> now, you guys are a newer couple, so obviously, since you've started spending time together, yeah, how many times answered, do you think? I answered uh, not like um, not like Gigi. I answered not from knowing past stories. I answered within our relationship. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. So Troy, what do you think that uh, Frank said? At least a couple once. Or one. We'll be specific. Okay, I'm thinking. <laughs> Don't doubt yourself. <laughs> it's traumatic, I know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not something I'm proud of. Yeah. <laughs> but it's the Hey Poopy Podcast. We celebrate you and your yeah. accidents. I'd say maybe a couple times, twice. Oh. And Frank, what did you answer? Oh, oh sorry. Frank said he sharted once that I can recall. Yeah. I heard that buzzer. Yeah. And you got it. Once the first time. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Gigi Bonbon, we asked Kyle. Kyle, has Gigi ever farted while having sex? Gigi Bonbon, what did Kyle answer? Yes. All right. <laughs> I can't remember any specific times, but I'm sure she has because she's always farting. <laughs> 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 That's the best. I love that. <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> All right, Troy, same question. Has your partner, sorry, we asked Troy this question. So Frank, you're going to give us the answer for this one. Has your partner ever farted while having sex? I think I know the answer to this one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. What? Yeah. Like, yeah. No. <laughs> but sex Let the yeah. <laughs> All right. It's like the queef in the gay world. Yeah. Exactly. It's like, I don't know anybody who has butt sex and there's no farting. Exactly. If they say that there we're, isn't, they're lying. We're getting on to our last question of the evening, but we want to do a little, um, we should well, figure out who's last, in the lead. Who's last like, two for each, yes. last question for each person. We're rounding the corner as it is, but we so, just want to get, I think we should do a little check-in with the um, score here. Right now, Gigi and Kyle are at 13 points. And in the lead, Frank and Troy at 14 points. So, Gigi and Kyle, you have two more questions to catch up. A lot of game left. left. Ready? And, Kyle, we asked the lovely Gigi Bonbon, have you ever farted on your partner on purpose? Has Gigi Bonbon ever farted on you, Kyle, on purpose? What Definitely. did she answer? Definitely a yes. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right. Love it. Love is right. in the farts. Okay. We asked Frank, Sorry. a panel of these uh, crack. We had, some, we had some, some scientists back there asking these, uh, formulating these questions. <laughs> but it's the same question. We asked Frank, have you ever farted on your partner on purpose? So, Troy? Yes. <laughs> 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 and Frank says many times on his butt, on his member, when in bed, in his face, for shits and giggles. And this answer just keeps going on and on. <laughs> nice. Last question for our Gigi Bonbon bon. on Kyle, number nine. Gigi. Which of the two of you is more likely to forget to flush the toilet? <laughs> what did Kyle answer when it came to which of the two of you forgets to flush the toilet? Kyle would say me. But to my defense, our toilet doesn't flush well. So <laughs> I'm, I'm blaming the toilet. But I... what would Kyle answer? Me. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. All right. 
Okay, All right. you Last guys. Last question for Troy here. But also, we are literally tied. So no pressure, to Troy and Frank. If you lose this one, we go into the tiebreaker round. Okay. If you mm-hmm. win this one, you win our fabulous prizes from B Vibe and Bamboo. Yes. So with that, last question. We asked Troy. It's all on you, Frank. We asked Troy, which partner is more likely to forget to flush the toilet? <laughs> what do you think? Let's hear that answer. Here's answer. The- Take your head off. You know <laughs> all right. Wow. You guys, thank you so much. And congratulations to our first annual Know Your Booze Poo Game. Troy, the trainer, and Frank, the coach. Congratulations, my friends. You guys won not just one, but two fabulous prizes. From B-Vibe, you got three butt plugs with a bunch of other stuff to go with it and 24 (laughs) rolls of bamboo toilet paper. So you get to clean that ass with an environmentally safe toilet paper. Thank you so much. You can't wait. Fabulous prizes. Again, thanks to... uh, yeah, yeah, please. Yes, please. <laughs> and a big a big thank you to our sponsors, uh, B Vibe and Bamboo. And again, if you'd like to check out any of these out on products, fabulous products, you can get a discount code. Uh, the first being B Vibe, bvibe.com. You can get type in the promo code B Vibes and get twenty percent off. Or you can go to go geobamboo.com, type in hey poopy and get ten percent off your order. Yes. So again, thank you to B Vibes <laughs> and Go Bamboo. Really quickly, just to be for shits and giggles, there was one tiebreaker question. Do you guys all want to answer and go around the room? Yeah, sure, yeah. How many poops does your partner take in a day? Let's start with Kyle. How many poops does Jill, Gigi take in a day? Two. Gigi? About two. Ah, and what would you say for Kyle? Um, what would I say for Kyle? Like five? <laughs> <laughs> Kyle? I don't know. Five plus. Five plus. <laughs> and five Frank plus. and Troy, how many poops would you say each other would make in a day? Thank God you have those two toilets. Um, When I, we first met, I would have said, like, you're like Kyle. It was like five. But now, um, two to three. Oh. Troy? Yeah. That's yeah, it, right. And Troy, what would you say about Frank's? Uh, one. Yeah. <laughs> one, one to two. One to two for me. Yeah. A good day is one. Like one massive one. Yeah. yeah. That Those toilets in your apartment get a workout. I know that much. They really do. Yeah. <laughs> nice. a very strong flush. Oh that was so much fun, you guys. Yes. Yeah. And that was awesome. Prizes were won. We learned way, we learned a lot about you guys. And you definitely know your booze poo. Yes. For sure. <laughs> <laughs> so with that, um, for everybody listening at home, thanks again for laughing and learning. I actually, blo- well, I'm laughing and learning with this game. This is a... Uh, Hopefully a new annual thing we're going to be doing. Yes. And happy pooping to all you Valentine's lovers out there. And enjoy your butthole. Yes. It's time to play everyone's favorite game. No, you're 